Man, look at all these instructions. They look pretty cool. Got the weapons. I got the cloak. All right. Yeah. All right, Pangu Toys. I'm going to need you to calm down. Jeebus. Come on now. <laughs> what was that? All right, Pangu. Hey there, everybody. How y'all doing? Hope everybody, hope everybody's having a wonderful day or night, and welcome back to my channel. As always, I'm Deluxe. All right, let's do another freaking transform review because I love some freaking transformers. Today, we'll be taking a look at Pangu Toys. This is their Lion Face Commander. This is their Leo Convoy or Lyo Convoy, and there he is. All right, looks pretty good. Now, he comes with tons of accessory, comes with tons of hands. Um, right now, he has a closed fist. That's the one they tell you to use in the instructions when you're transforming him. But you got these, uh, they're just blue plastic, but you got several, uh, you know, you got a pointing finger, you got a saluting hand and stuff, so that's pretty cool. Now, you also got these uh, guns and stuff. So you got these double blasters. You get two of these, nicely painted. Let me move this out of the way real quick. Uh, but you can use these on alt mode and bot mode as well. But, you know, gold paint, gunmetal gray. Looks really good and it got a nice sheen to it. You get two of those. You do get his blaster, you know, remnants of the Optimus Prime gun. Once again, that is painted too as well. Very nice. You get a sword and it is nicely painted too. You got the gold and silver like that. You do get some, you get two blast effects. These are the same ones that came with their Omega Supreme. So you can take this part and everything so that's cool and the last thing you get is a cloak uh, for his bot mode and it is red and got a nice gold now in the instruction it shows you how to tie it i don't i can't tie it i can't figure it out how to do it um but there you go it's got some uh you know nice it will fit you know you can you know move it around it's got some wires or something or it's like flexible uh material but really good pretty cool so i'm going to use that hopefully i can try to fit his uh you know head and everything so yeah you get that so that is it so here he is let me see if i can 
Move down a little bit. See that grr. All right, very nicely done. Lots of paint. This is gold. Now, when he comes packaged in, the uh, the lion head and the tail are not on there. You have to, you know, they're on ball pegs. Um, even in bot mode, uh, you have to take the tail off to to use the uh, you know the cloak. Uh, but yeah, they're just on a ball peg. You just pop them right in. And then also the unicorn, uh, the horn is not on there. You just plugged it in. So, all right, that's nice, beautiful blue eyes. Uh, you can open his mouth. Nice silver teeth. Really nice. This gold is good, so you can move that. These move out, and they're on a hinge, and this moves up and down too as well. As far as articulates for the head, it's on a ball peg. Nice swivel. You can look up, look down, you know, get you all you want and everything. Sorry about that. Now, the only thing is, the only issues I really have with the alt mode is nothing tabs in. Like, this is just on an armature right here. You can see that, and the tail is on an armature, and it doesn't plug in. So, you just basically just sitting there and everything. So, all right. Love the cherry red. You got the gold. Um, go back right here. Now this is die cast right here, all the way down to here. And the toes back here are good die cast. These are not die cast in the front. So he does have a good weight to him. Uh, here he is, he, you know, there's just his arms, you know, in bot mode. So you got up there, back and forth, a swivel. You got a bend right there and they bend at the paw too as well. And with the back legs, you got, you know, out here, back and forth, a bend right there, uh, bend right here and a swivel you know it's on a ball peg and everything so very nicely done with that uh you have these little parts and like i said these are where the guns are going to go you can put them right there and one right there and this is these little things are on ball pegs as well everything's on a ball peg basically to be honest <laughs> and uh, the tail you can it's on a ball peg you can move up and down you can swivel it and this moves as well these are sharp be careful so that's nicely painted gold so very, very nice. So there you go. That is the, I love that tray of red. So there you go. There's that. And like I said, you can use the, it shows in the, the um, instructions to use these. And I think that looks pretty cool. But like I said, nothing really tabs in. It just basically just sits on each other. So there you go. All right. Well, that is uh, Pangu Toys Lion Face Commander in his uh, alt mode, his GUR mode. All right. Here's Wheelie, Mad Square Prowl. You got Red Alert. You got uh, Dust Buster uh, jazz, and then you got Senator Shockway back there for some scale. Let's take a look at this little kitty. All right, love the head scope. It is prime. <laughs> so you got the nice silver, uh, light blue eyes right there. Silver, silver. I think the blue is painted too as well. So all of that is painted. Love the cherry red. It got some nice uh, light blue right here and silver right there. Cherry red throughout. Looks good. Silver and gold. All this is you know mainly painted. So very nicely done. All right, so you can look down quite a bit. Not much up. I uh, kind of wish you could look a little up better, but not much. Uh, side to side and give me a little attitude as well. You got the 80 woman, 80s women working shoulder pads on each side. And they can move. Like I said, they're on these little armatures back here on ball pegs. So you can move them out of the way if you want to. You know, this can move the tail just like the, you know, in alt mode. And with the line head too, you can open the mouth and all that stuff if you want to. All right. Let's try to move this out of the way a little bit. So with the arms, you know, same way you can move in there so up to there and go all this is going to get in the way a little bit let me see if i can 
try to move this out of the way. All right. All right. So go all the way around. There you go. You got a nice, nice double elbow. Looks good. And it fills in right there. That's cool. Bicep swivel. Uh, this swivels as well. And the hand swivels. Uh, now to replace them, they're just all in these little ball pegs. You just pop them off and you can change out the hands if you want to. So very nice. All right. Move this out of the way. All right. You got a waist swivel. Well, that's going to get away, but it's not in the way because it's usually up there. All right. And your waist swivel. A little ab crunch, I guess you can call that. Not much. Uh, you can't look up very much anyway. So yeah, just a little wiggle waggle right there. All right, these little things right here on the back, like I said, they're going to hold the guns. Uh, you can move them up and down, and they move around too as well. They're on ball pegs. Like I said, everything is on ball pegs. Um, uh, Van Dam all day, every day. You got the crotch little thing right there. Kick up to about right there, then it starts moving out like that way. Uh, kick back about right there. Thigh swivel. Nice uh, double knee bend. Looks good. The knee kind of fills out right there. Not bad at all. Once again, cherry red, gunmetal silver, gold. All right. Uh, you got the chicken feet. A little chicken feet. It looks like a chicken. All right. Uh, you can go toe tail up. You can go up to there like this just because of transformation. Not much back, but the toe does go by itself too as well up and down. And you got a nice little rocker. And like I said, the legs from down here are all as a die cast. Uh, I'm sorry. Right here, starting the calf is die cast. The feet are die cast too as well. This part right here. This is plastic. All right, let me fix this up a little bit. And here is the back. Like I said, you can move those down. There's the back of it. All righty there. There you go. All right, real quick. Here he is with his cloak on. I know I don't have it on right. Uh, you can do it anyway. Like I told you at the beginning, at the beginning, you you had to take this off the tail. You don't you don't have to. You can if you want to, uh, but you can keep it on if you want to, and just situate the best you can. Like I said, this it does have some like wires or something in it, and so you can pose it. You know, and looks pretty cool. Uh, but I know I don't have it tied right. I just you know just you know just want to show you how it looks. You know, with the cape. You know, the uh, or the cloak on. So uh, you can, you know, mess around with it and do whatever you want with it and all that stuff and pose it and everything. So it's pretty cool they included it. I think it looks pretty cool. But yeah, if you mess around with it, you can get it better than what I did. <laughs> so there you go. There he is with his cloak on. Real quick, there he is holding his weapon. He got his gun. You can hold a sword just fine. And like I said, you could put the guns in back here and you can put the blast effects and they can move around. Like I said, they're on uh, a swivel up here and some, you know, ball pegs right there. So... There you go with his weapons. Like I said, you can switch out the hand, just pop it off, and you can do that. So that's all of his um, accessories. All right, so there he is next to the uh, Iron Factory. Right there. You, you can tell he is not Legend Scale. I really thought they were Legend Scale. And then you got the uh, Legacy Evolution one as well. So he is a, a little shorter than Voyager Scale. So I guess he could work with Chug if you want to, I guess. Uh, but there they are. Um, I think they look good. These two look good together. This one, you know, it's it's out of place a little bit, but it's all right. Golly, look at that lion face. But yeah, there they are together. There's the three I have. And there he is next to you. got the Prime. You've got, you know, Side Swipe, Ironhide, and you got the uh, Studio Series Cheetor. And I threw in Megatron, which is a new age. And I threw in Core Class Wheelie. And you got Tits McGee, Retgar. So see, it's a weird kind of scale. I guess they're doing their own thing because... He's, I guess he could, you know, he's bigger than a deluxe, but also smaller than, you know, Ironhide is a deluxe as well, but it's a bigger deluxe. Uh, but he's not quite Voyager size. So I don't know. It's a weird scale, but there you go. Crapper Goners, Crappy Tool Paper, Triple A Battery, Carmex, Care Bears, Kicker and Squeaks. More scale. And real quick, there he is next to their Omega Supreme. That's the clear version. Scale. All right, folks, let's talk about some Pangu toys. This is Lion Face Commander. Uh, this is their Leo Convoy or Leo Convoy or Leo Prime, whatever you want to call him. Overall, I really like him. He's awesome. I really do love the accessories, tons of accessories. Love the cloak, the sword. Uh, you get the guns. They're all painted. So is the sword. You get a, some, you know, tons of uh, hands. You get the blast effects. 
man, it's awesome. Really like the uh, like the uh, accessories, man. That's really good. Line mode, pretty cool. You know, I like it. You know, he's really posable. And uh, only thing is, that, you know, the head or the tail doesn't really tab anywhere. It just kind of sits there, but it gives it great articulation. So it's really cool. I like that. Uh, transformations, easy peasy. I mean, all you really turn around the legs and turn, you know, turn around the tail and the, and the uh, uh, you know, line face. You know, and you got it. Uh, paint wise, beautiful. Love it. Love the cherry red. You got the blue, silver, gold. Really great on the paint. Uh, the materials feel good. You know, you got some die cast right here on the legs and on the uh, feet. So you got a nice weight to it. Uh, yeah, so and mostly everything is on ball pegs, like I said. So if you pop something off, you just pop it back on. So I, I didn't think I was going to break anything anyways, uh, but really nice on the materials. Uh, it feels good. Yeah, it just feels really good. Uh, articulations, good across the board. You know, you get mostly everything you need, and uh, I like that. Got some great poses. But I really love the, the cloak. I, don't, I know I didn't probably do it right, but um, you can work with it and make it your own. You know, just have fun with it. Uh, but yeah, overall, really like it. Only thing, the issue, biggest issue I have is scale. I mean, I don't know what he goes with. I mean, I guess if you want to stylize Chug, uh, you know, one, uh, he, he, he he's a little smaller than the Voyagers, but he's a little taller than the Deluxes. So he's around that area. So if you want to stylize, you know, I guess they might be doing their own, uh, you know, their own scale. Uh, but if you want a stylized uh, Leo Prime or Leo Convoy, man this is good i really it's a it was fun it's a great great transformer i like it i really do um and you know he does have you know no uh, you know just like omega there was no uh, uh ratchets or anything but um in the hips i don't think they're you know that loose at all you know so i think they're going to be okay especially when they have die cast i thought that was going to be a problem but not really he holds the pose and really good so yeah I, I recommend him he's fun i like him like i said with the accessories i mean you're gonna have a great time with him all right hit me up with some likes share prayers and care bears Hit that sub button for me if you don't mind. Hit me up some comments. I love reading your comments. And I guess I'll see you in the next Transformer review. And as always, be good to yourself. Man, hell freaking Pangu toys and hell freaking Transformers. And good night, folks. I have the power. What are you talking about, Prime? No, I'm He-Man. Look at my sword. Look at my battle baby over there. Rawr. <laughs> Sad. And oh my gosh, that is Skeletor. What do you mean? That's Alpha Bravo. I'm fixing to stick my sword up his butt. What? Well, first of all, He-Man would never say that. Yeah, I, well, I apologize. I got a little into it. I'm sorry about that. Sorry, everybody. Sorry, I was just playing. I'm, I'm not He-Man, but you like my sword? Yeah, it's a nice sword. Okay, everybody. Thank you. All right, floor time. You gotta love it.